what is up everybody and welcome to a brand new vlog and today first things first it's not even the morning yet we really have to cut down those bushes it's not really the morning now it's more of daytime but i was getting some things sorted out i'm texting a bunch of professionals that know their work to make sure that the builders have done the right work that they finished off anyways we're gonna see how that works out <sighs> hopefully i'll have somebody today because i don't want to hold the people's money if they did everything right well then they should be paid as quick as possible anyways i'm texting about we're gonna go take some pastry stuff for evelina because she really wants some stuff out of a bakery where my friends work we're gonna check out and those are the friends that I made friends with when I had a shawarma place because they had the bakery, I had the shawarma place. And we usually just chilled out all the time during work time. So let's start up the American V8 and get going with the day. And if you don't know, I'm a Russian guy that records his everyday life in Russia. So if that interests you, you might as well subscribe to the channel. And even if you press the like button right now, I would really appreciate it. That sounds good. Here's the bakery. Where's the guys at? Здорово. всем привет. Давай, выпечка лучше. Здорово. О, look at him speaking English. <laughs> You got the inside experience of what's going inside the bakery. Короче говорят, наш випечка ему понравится, да? Ваня. Well, you know what, guys? Today is one of those days where I got to take Evelyn and my sister out to the shopping mall because they got to get something for school. And when I mean them, I mean my sister. So I'm gonna bring them over there and we're probably gonna see how much electronics costs because a lot of people are probably very interested in that because of the the price of ruble to dollar and stuff like that. So we're gonna see how much does an iPhone cost. And I actually wonder how much will an iPhone cost once it comes out. On the bad news is I got a bit of a flu. I think it's from swimming in that freezing water. And now my nose is congested. I have a cough. And yesterday I had a temperature before, well, while I was doing the live stream. So anyways, let's get over and see where the day takes us today. Guys, I, you know, I don't drink cola that much anymore or any fizzy drinks, but I had to get myself one today and it's a Coca-Cola. And you might be wondering, Ivan, how the heck did you get yourself Coca-Cola? I got it at the bakery in my neighborhood where I got some stuff for breakfast. And guess where the Coca-Cola is made? Kabul, Afghanistan. You, you can't even see it, it doesn't wanna focus. But trust me on my words, it says Afghanistan right here. So time to try out a bit of Afghan cola. Smells like Coke. Well, you know what? It tastes like Coca-Cola from Afghanistan, if you ask me. Only macaroni. It's Evelina's favorite word. <laughs> How the heck did they get Coca-Cola from Afghanistan here? This is crazy. Anyways, let's get going with our day. But that is just too funny, honestly. Afghani and cola. Well, we came over to the shopping mall right now. Here's my sister walking around with Evelina. You wanted to see her in the vlog? Here she is walking around. She is already getting taller and taller. I remember her a little baby. Now she's getting bigger and stronger. Anyways, they're gonna go and uh, find themselves. Well, Evelina is gonna go with her because she likes clothes and she likes to get people clothes and stuff like that so that's what they're gonna be doing what we're gonna be doing is we're gonna be checking out the electronic stores because that's what i love nothing better than a bit of electronic stores anyways i'm walking through a shopping mall right now and the only stuff i really like about shopping malls is 
the shops that have like all sorts of stuff like technological stuff I'm not a big fan of walking around buying clothes and looking at clothes that's what Evelina loves and there's a lot of other people that do love that I don't like it I like some electronic stuff that's exactly what we're gonna go and check out right now here's the shop by the way that we're gonna check out so talking about MacBooks and stuff like that this is like one thousand nine hundred dollars see it's a MacBook Air with 512 gigabytes and this is two thousand seven hundred dollars for a macbook pro 500 gigabytes that's one heck of a price if you ask me anyways let's go see if they have any gopro stuff around in this shop maybe they have what i need i don't know oh look at this guys they put some gopro 8s out for 290 dollars very nice but they don't have what i need though unfortunately i don't think nope so they have some wi-fi stuff here which is cool like a wi-fi lamp very nice if you need to turn it on or off somehow i have no idea how this works am i the only guy who has a computer who really likes mechanical keyboards like this nothing better than the sound of it look how cool it looks like pretty sure this is for some game this just feels nice what is that this is even plugged in you could see it has a, a rainbow effect here or something like that I don't know oh, nothing better than the feel of some keyboards oh this logitech one looks cool but i'm not a big fan of keyboards like this this is like a typewriter type of stuff oh this feels really bad Holy cow, guys, look what I found in this uh, store. Oh, wait a minute. Yes, let's try again. Playing some 18 bit Pinotronics, whatever that is. Look, I'm walking around. Holy cow, what am I doing? What is this? I have no idea how to play this. Oh, get away kill somebody holy cow played some game anyways let's check out fridges and stuff like that for the apartment as well well the ps5 costs 620 dollars I don't know if it's a good price or not. I love steering wheels like this. $380. Still very expensive. Very, very expensive. This is what you gotta this is what you gotta do when you have an apartment and you're working on it or a house. You look at fridges. How, how the heck do I open this? Metafresh. Very nice. Oh, it's chilly inside. Very cool. So fish, vegetables, meat, fruit. Oh wow, look at this. Living technologies. Does that regulate the temperature? Or is that what you choose what's inside? Fruit or vegetables? Very cool. Well, it seems like I found the perfect washing machine for the apartment. It costs 900 bucks, right? But listen to this. It washes the clothes and it also dries it. Very nice. This is like a dream washing machine. I don't know if I'll be able to get this this is like the perfect flipping thing because you don't have to waste space to dry anything you could just put everything in one thing and get it dried up and washed guys have you seen one of those boards where you could just play chess by yourself so you make a go and then apparently it should go by itself i have no idea how probably gotta press this button and go let's see we tried it's trying to do something nothing is happening it tried to move one of them Okay, let's try for example. Oh, it's because I went the wrong way. Oh, it's not gonna move. Never mind. I have no idea how to play chess. Let's turn it off. Break the flipping thing. Now, would you buy yourself one of them for $1,000 into your house? I don't know. So I'm guessing that the prices are higher by like $100 slash $200. Guys, tell me how much does a uh, 
MacBook Pro with 512 gigabytes cost you wherever you live that's actually interesting to know because I'm pretty sure it's only like a hundred or two hundred dollars more expensive is it now or is it not I have no idea now I'll tell you one thing I've been to that electronics store now I have no idea what I'm gonna do and my sister and Evelyn are gonna be walking around for a very long time so God knows what I'm gonna be up to so now I gotta find myself an activity of what I'm gonna be doing because I have absolutely no idea there gotta be something fun to do in this shopping mall because I checked out some fridges I checked out some washing machines I showed you the price for a MacBook the iPhone costs $1,200 by the way and that is not the pro version so the pro version probably costs like $1,400 anyways time to find something to do but I have no idea what though let's see what we can find in this shopping mall oh I just found another electronics store so hello and another one called Polaris but I'm gonna go to M video and check out what they have in there well I found a MacBook Air for $1,000 well $950 because it has a 256 gigabyte of memory still very expensive this place doesn't have a lot of Apple products but it still has a lot of stuff for sale the flipping screen and stuff guys check this out the screen it's like the size of a television huge it's like what I use but I use a TV but this is like a proper 4k screen what is up with this mouse this mouse is just unbelievable well look at that 480p quality very nice very nice is it any good? I don't know. The internet is crap here. And <laughs> has pirated windows as well. It says activate windows. Very nice. Okay, it doesn't work. I'm actually surprised you could get yourself a scooter, electric scooter for $200. Look at this, very nice. And I've talked to one of the sales guy and uh, he was trying to sell a PS5 to a guy. And I heard him talk about that you have to have your PS5 account registered in Turkey because if they found out that uh, you're in Russia they block your PlayStation 5 could you imagine that and you can't use it at all so that sucks right so basically if you're in Russia you cannot play PS5 you need to find ways to avoid sanctions somehow and that is to make an account or a bank account in another country and use it that way guys i just noticed a place that i must go into and that is that go-kart over there look a huge go-karting place right there definitely gonna go over there i think i need somebody to go with me i'm gonna give edward a call because he's in moscow right now he might be coming back i haven't been karting since turkey so we might as well check it out it looks quite fun though it's smart the way they use parking to make a go-kart track out of it. Very cool. And right now I came because I was so bored of doing anything that I came to have a coffee over at some cafe that has a balcony. Very nice. Well, I could not hold myself to have a bit of this. Cream soda. Very nice. Nothing better than a bit of cream soda. Anyways, I'm so tired. I'm gonna wait for my sister and Evelina in my car because I'm just not bothered. <sighs> Had a coffee. It was just too boring now, you know? Too flippin' boring. I can't, I hate being in the shopping malls for way too long. Well, guys, we stopped the video over at the car. And you know why? I just have a really bad flu and I'm not feeling too well. So it kind of ended abruptly at that parking lot sorry about that guys but hopefully the vlog worked out and hopefully you guys enjoyed some of it so if you did enjoy it comment something press the like button subscribe i would really appreciate it now i'm sorry once i get back into some good shape we're gonna be bringing some videos over but now i have a temperature congested nose and a cough very nice see you later guys